Johnson ready to go for Team Tiger. As Gus Malzahn interception, significant playing time, and then completing the ball at a high, very high percentage. Into the air for the first time. Gus Malzahn's offense. Back up the middle. That'll be on once. He can be a special piece to this offense. Auburn with that quick strike offense. Set back. He gets the football and not a lot of room on the right side. A number of years in a row in that department, but you get a, a passer like Jeremy Johnson. In complete passes, Dave. It, it. Johnson again. On the outside to Duke Williams. Williams got the yardage, and look at the bounce. First carry of the afternoon by Rock Thomas, and he is rock solid. And Yul Carson's extra point is up and good. For some of the running backs, we don't know yet. Uh, they really matured since last year. I mean, last year they had me and Ford to look to, but I mean. Cameron Artis Payne, a good one, and so is Sean White, who started off with a pass. Comp High school. Boy, Small Zahn probably wants to see how he can handle this kind of tempo. How can he react when you speed things up? He had, he talked. First, first down of the afternoon. And White. He's done a nice job. And doing so. And again, make it three for three. Swift. White going to work on third and one. Up the middle it goes to Peyton Barber. It gave us fits, you know. How, how do you do that? And, and the knowledge that they share. Completion of the afternoon for either quarterback. Makes it second and ten. White, the pressure got to him that time. On, he takes his position. Behind the offensive huddle. Holding is the call. And a nice play, Network Plus. So they're going to have the punters punt, and they won't return it. Max Andre. And it's, it's really, and I know the quarterbacks don't want to hear it, but you really get almost a different look with each one of the quarterbacks as well. A lot of versatility in this offense. There is a rock. An incompletion to this point this afternoon. He's four for four to start this A day game. That bell boy. Oh. Reese Swain had the penetration and Thomas got around him. Here's Johnson again. First and 10 at the 48. Thomas again and he got a hold. Thomas, three rushes, 58 yards. Wow. Johnson, after his first incompletion, goes right back to work. He just doesn't seem to get rattled. Oh, he got 50 yards out. It's long enough. And it's straight enough. Just on bringing this offense to life this year, guys. Great point, Maria. Ron Robinson best respond to competition. There's always someone pushing you, and you can't have a day, a day where it's a bad day of practice. I think he's done a heck of a job this spring. And he has shown well today. White stands in there. Being pushed. Sean White is doing that to Jeremy Johnson. Flag on the play. Before the snap, false start. Number 67 offense. Five yard penalty. Still first down. In front of his head coach, Gus Malzahn. Here's Robinson. Those are things that he can do. He catches the ball well out of the backfield as well. It's protecting the quarterback. The young Sean White. Trying to get a matchup on the outside. There's Kevin Phillips with the punt that will not be returned, and it's a beauty. Don't catch on one of the drops. The other drop was on Duke. So Johnson now from his own end zone. And Johnson now, second and ten. Going deep again. Just got the snap off before the play clock expired. And that's to receive the 
45. And it goes out of bounds. Chance to work with Rock Thomas in his backfield. Boy, didn't that make any difference? Who's back? <laughs> they take over at the 45 yard line. Out of the backfield, that's Jason Smith. And a ball on the ground. In on the play. And it brings up third down for Sean White. King of kicks here in the A Day game. The 15 yard line. Uh, you know, they're competing real good. That's why I feel. How about that catch? Right here. That would do Ricardo Lewis 49 yards, and here goes Johnson again, and it is a shot. Duke Williams. And he comes down with it. Personal foul. Pass to the face, number 92 defense. 50 yard field would have been forced on the succeeding play after the try. Touchdown. Hear what you're seeing down there. That's old territory for you now. <laughs> White. This time they go to the outside. Brings up a third and 17. White with a draw play. We had a couple things come off the edge, but that's a credit to the defense they're getting after. Good stuff. Dave. All right, Andre. So the change of possession now. And Jeremy Johnson and company. I bet you he doesn't want to scheme against you, though. <laughs> Down there in a second, and Andre will be in shells and helmet. Games last year. Trying to carve out a bigger role for himself, and that's a great. We are four minutes into this second quarter. Here at the A Day game in Auburn. Johnson back to work in punt formation. Jason Smith waits for it, and it's a good one. You guys oh are the skilled positions. You're the prima donna. You have to stay in the box. You're not ready for it down here. See, I was just going to kind of tee you up. and She just forgot. Got to get a camera up there. <laughs> Sean White back to work again. Marcus Davis on the... Here we go. Go. And there's a drop. Robinson in the backfield. There's Jason Smith. In the film offensively is the drops that have happened here in the first half. Mike fakes one way. This year. Former running back who wanted to get himself on the field. Tight day today. Uh, I'll tell you what, it's, it's, it's fun to get down there and get in the middle of some of that. To see it from you see guys flying around, always moving parts. And not many of us have had the opportunity to, to obviously be down there and see things from that perspective. When coaches talk about speed of the game and slowing it down. Oh my gosh, how difficult progression and then the check down. Holding number 53 offense, 10 yard penalty from the previous spot, replay second down. Receiver all the way down to the third progression. Johnson up top again. Oh, what a nice adjustment. He is an excellent blocker and catches the ball well out of the backfield. And there's another man wide open. Johnson, 25 yards. Johnson has had a big first half here in the A-Day game at Auburn. 12 of 19. Champ, they're really getting after their guys to get lined up faster. They feel like they're just walking around, waiting for something to happen. Alignment, assignment, and effort. In the run game and stopping the run, it's the back end that seems to be giving up some plays. Missed him a lot. Lance Thompson coming in to coach the linebackers, coming from Alabama. So some guys that he has some experience with. He put the helmet right on the football and forced that fumble. On the planes, and he says that ultimately teaching these new guys, installing a new system, is what excites him about all of them. White threw it up for grabs, and let's see who came down with it. And putting some pressure on Sean White. Inside handoff. Big-bodied receiver. 
And maybe Myron Burt has made a couple of nice grabs in his years. It's been one back. And this year may be a little bit different in favor of Trey Mason, but this year it may be three backs before uh, that have similar numbers, somewhere around seven, eight hundred yards apiece. Wow, and there's problems on the back end. At some point, start to get the young guys ready. 20 yards on that last completion. So, there's some guys stepping up. Richard Freshman Burton, as well as now Marcus Davis. That time, he's going to get hit with a sack. In the non green shirts are in there, and here's Tyler Queen at quarterback. There it is. His first pass. Got to get there, Ruth. a completion of Myron Burton. And then compete for this job. This mouse on set for a guy that was supposed to be going to his prom in a couple of weeks. He's been getting it done. Here. Tuberville, who we will see in a minute. For those of you who are asking, that is Tommy Tuberville. Tyler Queen's certainly going to have that without the jersey on. He is alive today. Queen 11 yards on the carry. There's a carry off the left. Tyler Queen. Doing a nice job on his opening series to get things underway here. Just see what everybody does well and then just kind of work from there. Nice play up the middle. But they did not get the same production at that H-back position, and that's what they've been so excited about this spring. To the end zone. And Queen's pass is picked off. Transfer from Georgia. 39 defense. Play results in the first half. Then, of course, the kick six. Kicks are short, they bring them out of the end zone. But I can tell you what, that play happened immediately. I think third or the middle of the field, bad, bad things happen, Dave. Boy, and there's another and There's Tucker Tuberville in there at quarterback and Kendall on the handoff. Yeah, but he was a little fellow then. Not anymore. Now in his junior year. And look at him on the keeper. A lot of time up in Cincinnati with his folks, but he told me yesterday he was headed up there for an internship and in finance for the summer. Overville <laughs> working on second and nine. Drive a lot. Overville out of the gun and into the fire. Jack Bjork on for the punt. You know, Coach Muschamp here on defense. Mm -hmm. uh, like I said, he's always been a great defensive-minded coach, and even playing against him in college has to do with the with the, coach, the coaches that are here. And even though they didn't coach us, they still opened the door for us to come here and uh, help be around their guys. And a pro-style type arm, um, he has the height, he has all the physical tools. And I was just talking to him on Thursday, you know, just about being a leader. I say you don't always have to say something to him in practice, but you can compete against him. And, I say most of the time you spend with your defensive guys is away from the game anyways. Yep. You know, that's like going out to eat, having dinner. Here at Auburn where you guys had a bunch of success. Yeah, it was great. Uh, one thing I say about that team is we had a lot of guys that uh, game time. And it was probably one of the hardest hitting college football games I've ever been a part of. Wow. And uh, it went down to the wire. I just remember Courtney Taylor on fourth and 12, catching a comeback on the sideline, and then on third and 10, to catch the out. You forget about last year, but you take it and you watch the film, Break it down and you be tough on yourself. Be critical on yourself to do with the, the circumstances and the situation that we have put them in by by going through that. And uh, for them to go there and capitalize and win it. And now trying to find a little depth. Mm -hmm. Get into the threes and fours here. Thanks, Wade. He's always had more touchdown passes than interceptions. Takes care of the ball at Auburn University succeed. You know, I, I had. Uh, some folks as Queen competes at this, you know, this program and all across the board, every sport program, like this, and you get this time to, to get some guys on film at full speed. Queen scrambles. Back surgery, just precautionary reasons to keep him out. He'll be the starter at left guard. He'll be watching his teammates. He absolutely was making that lobby. Jeremy Johnson. And because of that, the most important recruiting target in that defense. As Queen goes up top and gets himself a touchdown. Has certainly had some positive things happen for him.